How's it going guys? Welcome back to another DaVinci tutorial. Uh, today I just have something pretty quick I wanted to show you because this is something that annoyed the shit out of me back when I didn't know how to do it and I never really bothered looking up how to do it so I kind of just put up with it but this is something that bugs me a lot so I'm going to show you how to fix this. If you have this issue where you had a file um, on your PC and you had moved it or something, you'd moved the file to a new folder or to a new location or whatever the case may be, you'll have this issue where it's like all just red, um, DaVinci can't find it. So this is, this is just a random Skyrim video I was making for a different channel, but um, yeah, so this is like the audio, this is the voice over audio and you know, the only way around this, um, I used to just, whenever this would happen, I would just delete the entire project because like, you know, what, what else do you do? You know, even if you put the file back in the folder, I believe it still doesn't, you know, fix everything. So it's like, what do you even do? This is like 17 minutes of just lost footage, but what you can do is simply right click on whatever file it is and at the bottom it should say change source folder and you're gonna click that and so um, I have it on a right so you want it, so this is what this is what it used to be now you're gonna want to click browse on two because this is the old one this is where you're changing it from and this is where you're changing it to just click browse and then it's gonna be on my YouTube shit <laughs> USB or my hard drive and then it should be on this, in this, and it should be, <laughs> I have a lot of shit as you can see, it should be this, and then if you click open, and then change, give it a couple of seconds, and it should be found, there you go, I think, I, I just pressed control S, and it's been him. found, okay, we're not gonna press play, <laughs> but yeah, you can also do this for a bunch of different things by simply select, whoops, by simply selecting right clicking and then doing the same process. So hopefully this guy has helped you guys a little bit. I know I've lost several hours of my time to the this because I'm a bit I'm a bit of a scatterbrain, I won't deny it. Um but yeah hopefully I saved you guys some time <laughs> not having to redo all of your projects. Thank you for watching. If you if this helped you leave a like. If it didn't help you leave a dislike and peace out.